Good afternoon. The first cold wave warning of the season has been issued for parts of Chungcheongdo and Gangwon-do provinces, while a cold wave advisory is in place for here in the capital. Meanwhile, a heavy snow advisory remains in place for the Jeollado provinces, Jeju Island, and the easternmost islands of Dokdo and Ulleungdo. And those regions could see on and off snow until Wednesday, and Dokdo and Ulleungdo could receive up to 20 centimeters of heavy snowfall. Stay bundled up all day. The daily highs here in the capital will only make it to minus 4 degrees Celsius. Pegu will top out at 1 degree Celsius this afternoon. The cold snap will continue to grip much of the peninsula, but the cold will ease a bit on Friday and Saturday. And as the nation has been hit by severe winter weather, the Korea Centers for Disease Control and Prevention has issued alert for winter flu week earlier than usual. So this week, we'll have a very high chance of getting sick. Be sure to take good care of your health by washing your hands properly and eating healthy meals. With that, let's take a look at the international weather for beers around the world. Well, many of us in South Korea will have a freezing and cold weather with alerts being issued in some parts. Many regions in North Korea will have colder temperatures than the South. And as for the rest of Asia, nothing seems to be out of the ordinary in terms of weather conditions in Tokyo under mostly sunny skies. Meanwhile, early summer weather continues for much of New Zealand on this Tuesday. Heading to North America, a snowfall warning has been issued in Montreal with up to 20 centimeters of heavy snowfall expected through Wednesday. And as for South America, major cities will have a sunny to rainy Tuesday depending on the region. Taking you to Europe, those in London could face the coldest night of the season overnight and we'll see a high of 1 degree Celsius on Tuesday. Lastly, to Africa, those of you in Algiers, you need to have an umbrella and light jacket. It's going to be a rainy Tuesday. And that's all the weather update for now.